In this lecture, we're gonna talk about setting our daily budget. And yes, in Google Ads, we set daily budgets. We don't set monthly budgets. When you set a daily budget for your campaign, you're telling Google how much you want to spend each day, the maximum, you, the maximum you're willing to spend each day for this campaign. Google has updated a couple things with regards to the daily budget and how it works. You can actually spend up to double your daily budget but it won't exceed your daily budget over the course of an entire month multiplied by the average amount of days in a month. So that sounds a little complicated, so let's just quickly um, look at an example. So say for example, say for example I have a uh, daily budget of $177, okay? Now the average amount of days in a month, what you're telling Google is that this is what I wanna spend per day and Google will say like, okay, we get that. We might spend a little bit more. You might spend, a, you might spend a little bit more. You might spend a little bit less. But we will hold ourselves to that multiplied by 30. So if I take 177 and I multiply that by 30, what do we get? Do the math. Um, $5,310, I believe, right? So $5,310 is the most you're going to spend over the course of a month, which is actually 177 um, dollars a day but i could spend on any given day 177 up to double that right so that comes out to 354 okay so i could spend 354 dollars on any given day but i won't spend 354 dollars every day because then i'm going to greatly exceed my my allotted budget for the course of the month so it's a little bit of a weird system it used to be that google would really not go over your daily budget google has changed and they they will outright say that we could we could spend up to double your daily budget on any given day and the reason why they do that is because they say like okay if on any given day we feel that you could get more impressions and more conversions for keywords that you want to get then we'll give those to you and we we won't spend as much you know next week or the day before or something like that so i think i actually think it's a good system and we've seen better results in our campaigns um, as a result of this now change. how do you determine what your daily budget should be okay that's a good question there's no way to answer that for a new campaign the real way to go about figuring out what your daily budget should be is how much profit do I need to earn? What return on ad spend do I need to generate for these campaigns to be profitable? And remember, what we're dealing with here is salesmanship in pixels. Salesmanship is all about making a profit. And we've said this before, I'll continue to say this again. Everything we do, every, every, decision, we, every decision we make must be anchored to our desire and our ultimate goal for profit. But if you're, creating an, if you're creating a campaign for the first time, then there's no way to really know. So if you have um, a budget behind you and you're able to um, invest in testing what's going to work, then put a daily budget that's appropriate. So I can't tell you what that is. Whether it be $50, $500, or $5,000, I don't know. It could be $10, it could be $1. I mean, I don't think it's worth getting involved in the campaign at $1 a day. I would say at minimum $10 a day spread across you know one or two keywords at most. So in our case for now, I'm just gonna put in a quick, you know, $50 a day budget, it's a test account. And again, remember that this is just for this campaign. And now I'm going to delivery method. If I twirl down delivery method, which is an advanced setting, we have two options, standard delivery method and accelerated delivery method. And I wanna jump into a slide to explain exactly how this works. How do you want us to deliver those impressions to you? Do you want them all at once? Do you want them as fast as possible? Or do you want them throughout the day or throughout the maximum amount of time you have given your ad scheduling options? So let's see what that looks like. So advanced delivery method, um, when you click standard and you, when you choose standard as an option, you're optimizing the delivery of your ad spending budget evenly over time. That's what Google recommends. The translation of that is the same amount of impressions spread out throughout the day. So here's a visual representation of what that looks like. Let's say I'm bidding from, from 12 a.m. to 12 p.m. Um, I'm bidding 24 hours a day. My impressions will be a relatively even distribution throughout the day. So if Google knows that I'm gonna get, for example, you know, if Google knows the maximum amount of impressions that I can get is 2,000 impressions, they'll stagger those impressions throughout the day. So I'll miss out on a bunch of auctions early and you know, Google has enough uh, computing power to know exactly how to, how to give me that even distribution. If I choose accelerated delivery, I'm not optimizing the delivery of the ads. I'm spending my budget more quickly. I'm getting them as soon as possible. That's what I recommend, Adventure, Adventure Media. It's the best way to get true volume and project how much more impressions that are available for your keywords. This is, the way I sort of view it, especially in the beginning, is you wanna really know what's out there. But if you wanna really know how much could I spend, you know, what could I really get out of this, 
then I recommend accelerated budget. Yes, your budget might be depleted by 10 o'clock in the morning. It might be depleted two hours after your campaign's launch. Fine. And that's not great for the first day, but it's okay because you're learning. I'm learning that I could spend $50 by 11 a.m. and what results does that get me? You are missing out on a really, really important thing is to see do different hours of the day perform differently, which is why you'll have to eventually adjust, either increase your daily budget, or you could choose to switch to a standard delivery option later on. And that's totally fine. You could switch to standard delivery at any point in time in the campaigns. This is an option that could always be changed later. And just a visual representation of what this looks like, if I'm getting all my impressions, and this is what it would look like if I have uh, a lower budget than what I could actually get um, based on the maximum amount of search impressions in the locations that I'm targeting, et cetera, et cetera. And I would have those staggered earlier on. Now, of course, you could choose accelerated and your ads could show all day. And what would be the reason that that might happen is because the, the, the combination of two factors, which is my daily budget and the amount of available impressions for a given keyword search term ad group campaign are enough that my daily budget covers or exceeds the amount of maximum impressions that I can get. And that actually happens more than you'd think because not every keyword has a huge amount of volume. And depending on your match type, depending on your location settings, but depending on when your ads are scheduled to actually run. So it's quite common that we'll have a campaign on accelerated budget and our campaigns are running and our impressions are being, we're receiving impressions throughout the entire day or throughout the entire time we're actually having those ads scheduled to run. So I recommend going to accelerated, choosing accelerated to start, monitor when you start getting less activity and then decide whether or not you want to increase your budget based on profit, of course, based on exposure, based on what your, your sales team or your, your, your website can handle or, or how the results of the campaigns are going. Of course, that's different for everybody. So either change, change to standard or switch or increase your daily budget. So that's the advanced delivery method settings. Let's quickly jump back into, into Google Ads and select our settings, the ones that we want to use. Back in Google Ads, I'm going to click Accelerated. Google gives us this little notification, spending budget more quickly. This may cause your budget to run out early. Yes, we know that, but it's still what we would like to do. In the next lecture, I'm gonna show you how to find your time reports, how to show by hour of the day the results you're getting and how to start thinking about making optimization decisions based on those numbers. I look forward to seeing you guys very soon in the very next lecture.